finally, after you do the interview, it's extremely important that you and a colleague that you did the interview with debrief. Oftentimes, we leave an interview, we rush to our next meeting, and we didn't have a chance to talk about what happened there. Somebody who was observing may have noticed that the person you were interviewing leaned back and was inquisitive or shook their head and was really frustrated in a situation where you were so busy doing the interview you didn't notice, and that can be a big tell in terms of where a real problem is. At the end of the interview process, you should be walking away after several rounds with a much better understanding of what the problems are, where specifically the pain points are, and who they're for. This is all part of the validation process. And as I said earlier, you will iterate on this several times before you get it right. Part of that is developing your interviewing skills and getting better at it. And part of it will be revisiting things that came up to be sure you have things correctly.